A lot of people are needing to shift specimens today, and there are regulations uh, under the Department of Transportation and the International Regulations, or IATA, for shipping Category B. And quite simply, it's a three-part system of how you ship. First, you have your primary receptacle. Make sure that it's sealed uh, securely so that it's leak-proof. It then goes into a absorbent. The absorbent goes into the second part of the packaging, which is, in this case, a 95 kPa bag. This bag is then sealed so that it is leak-proof plus a 95 kPa. You also may have the example where you have a solid uh, container, a rigid container. Then, the third part of the packaging is an outer box. And in this case, it's this box where you put the specimen in there, close it up. Requirements for this box are that it's a rigid outer box. It has to have a minimum dimension of 100 millimeters or 4 inches by 100 millimeters or 4 inches. On the outside is a UN3373 in a diamond next to biological substance category B. Then you just have to put your instructions on where to ship it. AirC has a whole line of different packages for category B and category A packaging. To see those, go to www.aircdg.com.